guys! In the video today, I wanted to speak about five things you can do now to get your dream body in 2017. Number one, set a goal. What do you want to achieve? Do you want to lose weight? Do you want to gain weight? Do you want to build muscle? Do you want to build strength? Whatever it is, you should know what you want. And your goal should be realistic and specific. Which means if you want to lose weight, decide how much weight do you want to lose and what is the time frame. For example, I want to lose 5 kilograms until the 1st of April. Or if you want to gain strength, it could be something like I want to squat 10 kilograms more in the next 6 months. Number 2. If your goal is to lose weight, your task during the holiday season is to minimize the damage. It doesn't mean you can't enjoy Christmas and have nice meals with your family, but you shouldn't overshoot. I made a video on this topic, the Holiday Survival Guide. I will link it on screen at the end of this video. Number three, if your goal is to gain weight, if you don't want to lose weight, but want to get bigger, get more muscle, get more strength, then you should take advantage of all the Christmas meals and meals out with your family and friends. Just be sure to adjust your training accordingly. Before a bigger meal, go to the gym, do a really hard workout. That's another thing I spoke in the holiday survival guide. Number three, make a holiday routine. Routines are so incredibly important. They make it so easy to stay on track and reach your goals. For example, something from my personal life. A few years back, when I was at uni or in the lab all the time during the week, I was really good with staying on track, with my diet, with going to the gym. But then at the weekend, you know, I had the freedom to do whatever I want. And then when you wake up and think, oh, actually, you know, I could get up, but actually I could stay in bed. Or after your breakfast, oh, actually, I could finish my breakfast now and do something else. Or Oh, maybe I should just continue eating because I have time. Or, oh, maybe I should go and train now, but I could go to the internet and swell and do some surfing and go to the gym later. And then at the end of the day, you end up not going to the gym at all because it's already too late, the gym is closed, because you spend so much time doing something else, because you had the time and the freedom to do whatever you want. For this reason, make a holiday routine for you. It shouldn't be like a super strict, stressful routine, but plan what you're going to do to be sure that your diet is as close to your goals as possible and that you get your training in. Because it sucks so much after taking one or two weeks off, going back to the gym, you feel so, so bad. It happened to me as well. That's why I really get sure that I get my training in, even if I'm on holidays. Number five, think how do you want to reach your goals? If you want to train and improve your body composition, do you want to get a program? Do you want to pr write your program yourself? Do you want to get the program from the internet? Do you want to work with a trainer or a coach? Do you want maybe to join a group, to have a gr motivation within a group? Decide and think about it. What is the best thing for you? And then if you want to get a program from the internet, do your research on the internet. Check out what programs are out there, which ones fit for you, your lifestyle and your preferences the best. If you want to work with a coach, then look for different coaches online or maybe in your local gym. And then you're really motivated to stay on track during the holiday season, enjoy it, but still minimize the damage and take all the advantages of larger meals and of the free time and then start totally motivated and full of energy in the next year. This video was motivated by Ivan Carmichael's video he uploaded yesterday on the seven steps you can take now to get wealthy in 2017. I will link the video down below. It's really cool. So if you want to get wealthy, just check out his video. I hope you enjoyed this video. If you can think of two friends who could benefit from this video, who may find the tips useful I gave to stay on track, to set their goals for the next year, please share it with them. It would be really amazing. And if you haven't subscribed to my channel yet, it would be great if you would hit the button below and subscribe. And 
See you tomorrow in the next video. Bye!